Peace to everybody back with another video. This is after a demand for DNA tests on Michael Jackson's lookalike. The singer posts a video and fans go unbelievable. Now the other night I did prove a point that Michael Jackson and Sergio Cortez are two different people. Now they're um, demanding a DNA test but it's not going to happen because you know Sergio Cortez and Michael Jackson are not the same people at all. And people are just really demanding for a DNA test. After fans demand Michael Jackson's lookalike Sergio Cortez to undergo a DNA test to prove he's not the king of pop himself, the singer recently took to his social media to share an interesting video which made fans go unbelievable. Yeah, so that's what happened. He took to social media to prove that he is not Michael Jackson. Um, Sergio Cortez does have an Instagram account. I am following that one. He also has a Facebook account too. I, a fan, like, I am following that one as well. Now, as you can see here, this is Sergio Cortez himself. And this article is from Wednesday, January 15th, 2020. Since Michael Jackson died on June 25th, 2009, certain theories claim that the singer has been living a different life and has been living as an impersonator of his former self. After theories surrounding Michael Jackson, recently a lookalike of the singer was found on the internet. Known as Sergio Cortez, the lookalike was asked to prove he's not the singer himself by fans that undergo a DNA test. After fans demand a DNA test, Cortez recently took to his social media to share an interesting video that make, makes fans go unbelievable. Yeah, so ever since Michael Jackson had died on um, June 25th, 2009, there were certain theories claiming that the singer has been living a different life. Uh, no, Michael Jackson was not living a different life. He, Michael Jackson was being Michael Jackson. That's all he was doing. And they are saying that he has been living as an impersonator of his former self. What would be kind of hard to do when you're deceased? There's no way Michael Jackson was living at his, as his former self. And then after that, after theory surrounding Michael Jackson recently, a lookalike of the singer was found on the internet. Known as Sergio Cortez, the lookalike was asked to prove he's not the singer himself by fans and undergo a DNA test. So the fans are still demanding for him to get a DNA test. Um, and of course, Sergio Cortez is not Michael Jackson because it's impossible. There's no way Michael Jackson could live as an impersonator of his former self. It's kind of hard to do. Um, after fans demand a DNA test, Cortez recently took to his social media to share an interesting video that makes fans go unbelievable. Yeah, so Sergio Cortez did go to his social media to share an interesting video. And um, the fans did go unbelievable. On Instagram, Sergio Cortez shared a video of him performing at a concert as the singer shares his singing video on social media. All his fans worldwide go crazy and unbelievable looking at the interesting video. Captioning the video, Sergio wrote, Man in the Mirror Live, and looked just like Michael Jackson while singing on stage. In the video, Sergio is seen dressed in a pair of black pants, a white tank shirt, and a shimmery blue jacket. The singer dons Michael Jackson's signature black hat in the video while performing performing as well 
Yeah, so Sergio did take to his Instagram account. Of course, there's a picture of him on the Instagram account. Um, as the singer shares his singing video on social media, all his fans worldwide go crazy and unbelievable looking at the interesting video. Um, Sergio wrote Man in the Mirror live and looked just like Michael Jackson while singing on stage in the video. So this is what he was doing. Sergio also dressed in a pair of black pants, a white tank shirt, and a shimmery blue jacket. So that's what he wore. Um, the singer dons Michael Jackson's signature black hat in the video while performing. And as you can see here, here's the Instagram account of Sergio Cortez uh, dressed up as Michael Jackson. So before anybody gets any ideas, well, that no, it's not. This is Sergio Cortez himself. This is his Instagram account because I can recognize the heart and the, the message thing and the whatever. So this is Sergio Cortez's Instagram account. Shocked with Sergio Cortez singing, many fans took to his social media to leave comments lauding him. One fan wrote, that awesome and great. While another asked if Cortez met Michael Jackson's family ever in his life. Check the comments below. So Sergio Cortez was shocked singing. Many fans took to his social media to leave comments lauding him. One fan wrote, that's awesome, a great while. Another asked if Cortez met Michael Jackson's family. Oh, come on, really? Why would somebody ask that question? Only Michael Jackson know his family. And um, Sergio Cortez, I, I really don't believe he met Michael Jackson's family at all. I really don't. Me, <coughs> excuse me. Meanwhile, the King of Pop, Michael Jackson's death cause came, I'm sorry, out of as a shocker to many fans and left many heartbroken as well. Many fans are currently loving Sergio Cortez and his singing as the singer reminds them of the pop singer. But needless to say, Michael Jackson and his songs have a special place in everyone's heart and no one can quite literally take that. And it's true, nobody could take that. As long as we ha have Michael Jackson, the real Michael Jackson in our heart, his song, his music will always means something to everybody. Uh, meanwhile, the King of Pop, Michael Jackson's death came out as a shocker to many fans that left many heartbroken as well. Yes, it did left many heartbroken. And this, uh, and it was a terrible thing that Michael Jackson had passed away in 2009. And now there are people that are looking like him, but they're not him, though. But they are keeping his legacy half alive. And the liars like Wade Robson, Dan Reed, and James Safechuck all lying on Michael Jackson saying, oh, well, he didn't know. Dan Reed knew the truth. He just paid Wade Robson and James Safechuck a lot of money to lie about it. And, you know, it's just sad that these liars are getting away with it too much. And, you know, people are doing everything they can to keep Michael Jackson's legacy alive and proving his innocence. Leave your comments below. I am out.